Hello everybody, this is a review of the Scottsdale Mint. Three nines fine, ten troy ounce, chunky bar. Yep, prices were down, so I picked it up. It's uh what can you say? It's a ten ounce bar. Nicely stamped. It's a good uh good deep stamp in it. Three nines fine. And it's ten troy ounces. Yeah, it's nice and thick uh, compared to, say, like the uh, Germanium Mint 10-ounce bar. I just kind of compare side to side there. A little bit, you know, not as wide. But that's, you know, how you stack the uh, 10 in there. Interestingly enough, when you take a look at the back of this, you see how they have uh, got this little weird round part here and this round part there. See, it makes me wonder, uh, you see there's no, uh, or very light machining on the back here. Um, I've got another, here we go, there's a different bar, and you can kind of see that machining a bit, or what I would call machining, that could be, I guess maybe the way it solidifies, I could kind of see that, but to me it looks a little machined like to take off just enough to make sure it comes within weight but uh this makes me think that uh, they pour this outer shell first you see like there's this weird kind of ripple in the in the side it makes me think that they pour this piece first that, that like this shell here first and then they backfill in with uh other silver to make that weight so you have like this cup here and then they just go ahead and pour the molten silver in there. But that may not be necessarily the case. I can't say for certain. It's just the way my imagination runs. But yeah. I like the bar. It's neat. It's appealing. It's attractive. If you have a chance to pick one up or two up, by all means, go ahead and do it. Uh, much different than Scottsdale Stacker Bar. Of course, it ain't stacking on anything. But yeah, I do like that one quite a bit. So there you go. That's the Scottsdale Mint. 10 ounce chunky bar. Bye-bye.